The Bath Valley Vera area is certainly one of a kind. It offers a fun variety of opportunities from sunbathing to swimming to picnicking to bird watching and even turtle watching. Well, this area will soon be undergoing a major facelift under the Bathway Livera project. Crystalina Klein fills us in on the juicy details. Year after year, many families, both local and visitors alike, flock Bathway Beach for some form of recreation. They visit the popular Bathway Beach to picnic or just to relax and bask in the warmth of the sunshine and the caressing waves. Bathway, as you know, is an area visited by many of the locals for recreational purposes. Uh, it's yeah. great fun seeing everyone out playing. It'd be make your heart a little sa feel a little safer knowing that they're not you know at risk of being run down or, or uh, smashing a car with the ball as they uh, get stronger in their batting skills. <laughs> At Bathway, vendors can be seen daily, plying the trade, selling from food to craft, all in an effort to sustain their families, a practice that has gone on for years. But with the massive increase of visitors, both local and foreign to Bathway, little has been done to lift the environment from its basic look. All this is now changing. Product development has been on the minds of officials at the Grenada Tourism Authority for a long time and Bathway was one of their first projects. It was the government of Grenada along with other stakeholders like Specto and Ocean Spirits and the Grenada Tourism Authority who decided to undertake this adventure. Never in our wildest dream do I ever thought that we were going to have a vendor's booth at Bathway. A committee was put in charge with the responsibility to plan for the development of the entire landscape at Bathway. Officials say both a long and short term plan have been developed for the area. In recent months, this plan started to materialize. The first was the construction and official handover of the vendor's booth a few months ago. We cannot do this overnight, but there are some short term and long, long term plans which we, which we hope, when implemented, will no doubt impact positively on the further development and beautification of this magnificent area. So we're trying to do a good project, you know, enhance the offerings to the tourists and also enhance the experience as visitors, both locals. But in terms of Bathway and Bathway development, we'll be looking at some short-term measures, you know, um, looking at um, refining the landscape. This is one of the reasons why we have the landscaper with us today, for example. Um, once the boots actually are moved to the other area, we're looking at working with the different partners, different businesses within the community, um, because we have a nice team together that would look at moving that forward. Officials say the stage area at Bathway, often used for turtle watching, will be made into a much larger facility, fully equipped with electronic equipment. So what does that mean for vendors and patrons who frequent the beach? But well, the area is somewhat small, so we're looking at um, using a different area, make it bigger, put in new electronic equipment, you know. So even though you go to the center and the, inter the interpreter is not present, you can have an electronic interpretation of the whole area. This will also open up an avenue for more job creation as well as an increase in visitors to this beautiful area with its natural attraction. You have the opportunity to improve the quality and type of service which you offer. The vending facility is designed for six booths, right? So it will create additional livelihoods for people in the area because presently we only have three resident vendors. I think it's going to open the doors for not just food vendors but also people who have handicrafts or produce like we have some lovely people who produce their own local honey and I think it's going to do a lot for an ongoing day-to-day -day rather than just a weekend opportunity. I think it's going to do a lot for the economy that way, draw attention and provide a service for visitors and for local residents. Like with everything else, they too had their challenges and so the users of this new facility are charged with a great responsibility, the proper maintenance and use of the boots. 
we had a few challenges, quite a few challenges, and the facility would have cost the government of Grenada just over 221,000 EC. There have been bumps along the way, but we are at the end of a long road. I urge them to lift their game in that families can come to Bathway and get a proper meal on a Sunday and spend the whole day, you know, and look at, we have recreation for the kids, we have a lovely amphitheater, picnic areas and everything, we offer in camping, so all in all I think it's a good move. Cabinet has also appointed a committee to develop a protocol to enhance turtle watching both in Bathway and Livera areas which in the long term would contribute greatly to the tourism product. So you'd have more persons doing turtle watching research because the researchers who is um, Ocean Spirits, they have discovered that they have more turtles coming up on other beaches, even on Bathway beaches, beach, you know. But we more concentrate on liver, so we're going to be extending the, extending the whole turtle watching experience. The ministry's long-term view is that um, Persons can go to Bartway, like families, and spend the day and get a proper meal. You know, not just chicken and chips, you know, but a proper meal, you know. You have tables so you can picnic and everything. From all indications, the future of Bathway and its environs looks bright. And everyone, including residents, can expect a complete package from the vendors as they now have a more comfortable space to provide top quality service. Develops. We will. We're really looking forward to it. Thank you. I see Bathway developing to be an outstanding tourism attraction. I think that once you know um, the pieces of the plan are are anchored well um, and are developed in such a way that it's a holistic view, I can see that it doesn't only look at Bathway, the beach that everybody is known, but it also looks at the other parts of the offer, the, 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 the picnicking, the, the livera. I see um, livera being um, a, a stop that is unstoppable in the future. For State of Affairs, I am Chrislina Klein. And that's our picture this week from the home front. That's the current state of affairs. As we speak, our reporters and producers are gathering more stories from across Grenada as we prepare to tell them. I am Janelle Hamlet.